Hi everybody, I hope you're well and I've had a really good week so far. Today is part of our gut health series, we're looking at kefir. Now, kefir um, in studies has been proven to have many health benefits, so we're going to have a look at a few of these today and there is an article um, that goes into more depth in this um, too. So kefir is a tangy and um, fermented um, milk drink that's made from milk or um, sweetened water. There are actually four main types. There's um, goat's milk, there's cow's milk, there's coconut milk and there's sweetened water kefir. This probiotic food is made by culturing uh, fresh milk with kefir grains, uh, which are live colonies of um, yeast and bacteria, and they can be used over and over again. So um, I've put a recipe on the article today of how to make your own um, kefir, and you can use these grains over and over again on, um, for more batches, um, so that's there for you for later. Um, the bacteria actually ferment um, the milk and create a range of different um, substances um, including um, calcium, uh, potassium, proteins to name a few and um, these are really really good um, for our gut health. Kefir is great because it's really versatile. You can use it obviously to make smoothies or as a, a yogurt. Um, um, it, it's, it's slightly um, thinner than um, a thicker yogurt, um, which if you have a go at making your own, you'll see what I mean. So it's great in smoothies, also in soups too. So what are the health benefits that can be obtained from consuming kefir? Well, um, primarily um, it helps the digestive system, it's probiotic, so that's um, healthy bacteria to help the gut um, and to help, uh, help maintain a nice balance in the gut as well. Um, so um, we, we spoke in the last um, article of what's the difference between prebiotics and probiotics, so you can flip back to that to look a little bit more depth at what the probiotics do. Now, um, obviously, um, the digestive health and gut health is linked to every body system because if the gut's not right, then um, you're not being able to absorb and digest your foods in the right way. And this will have a knock-on effect on the immune system, the nervous system, hormonal system, etc. And there's also a lot of research out there now as to which strains and combinations of strains in the gut um, help to, um, to provide really good balance for overall general health. Um, a second health benefit that, that's been linked to kefir is um, how it helps to su support the immune system. It actually contains a very special fibre which has anti-inflammatory properties and um, it's been linked um, kefir um, to helping to um, increase a specific immune um, cells um, including um, T helper cells and T killer cells too. Um, in studies it's also been linked to helping to lower LDL, that's the bad cholesterol um, in the blood and also helping to lower blood pressure. So um, there's also studies um, into helping those that are lactose intolerant um, by um, the bacteria that are contained, the probiotic bacteria that are contained in the kefir helping to break down lactose so it's more easily digested. There's a lot more um, on this over on the article um, with a recipe of how to make your own kefir. Maybe you could send me um, some pictures um, to show me um, what you've made. Um, anyway, I really look forward to seeing you next week uh, with our next Gut Healthy Food. Take care. Hi everybody, I hope you're doing really well. Today is part of our Gut Health series. We're looking at um, kefir, which is a fermented food. It's actually a tangy fermented um, milk drink and it's, it's been proven to have many health benefits.